Every 25 seconds, someone in the United States is arrested for personal possession or use of drugs. Reporter Sabella Scalise is in Washington, D.C., taking a look at the Arizona ballot initiative to legalize marijuana. Experts at the briefing today say the single largest arrest category in the U.S. is for personal use of drugs, and they say that most of the time, suspects are carrying close to or less than one gram of drugs. We need a new approach, and we need it urgently. One in every nine arrests is made on charges of drug possession. That's true in both Arizona and the nation. The American Civil Liberties Union and Human Rights Watch say those small charges can lead to large problems for those convicted. The consequences of a conviction can mean that individuals and sometimes whole families are excluded from public benefits such as food stamps, housing, wages and job opportunities, and even the voting booth next month. And for non-citizens, it can mean possible deportation. With elections in less than four weeks, Borden says this is when change must begin. And that change can start with Arizona's marijuana initiative, according to supporters of the ballot measure, which makes possession of small amounts no longer a felony. They would not be a part of the court system. They would not be a part of the rehab system. They would not be a part of the private prison system. They would simply be healthy, responsible adults. In Washington, Sabella Scalise, Cronkite News.